Hey Froshi, we are always freshen up vehicles here, right? But every once in a while, we do something magnificent and we do something classy. And right here, we are in a classic gazelle and we are going to be transforming this car. We're not really going to do much, we're just going to make it classy like it is. So, watch out for this view. Excited to take this job and to do that fresh tech touch on it, you know? It's a privilege to work on this car. I personally, I love it. It's a um, very, very simple transformation. We are going to restore the old stainless and make sure that it is shining. And also, the upholstery, because it is supposed to be able to close and cover the car. But right now, everything is messed up. The steering wheel is damaged, the radio, nothing is working, the engine is not running very smoothly, but we are restoring this vehicle's performance and beauty, and we are bringing it back to life. I want you to anticipate and see what we are going to do on this car, and how the transformation process is going to take place. Trust for check on this one. We are going to make something significant, something classy. So, uh, part of the things we are going to be sorting out is see all of this, the rust, the wheels, everything is going to be rebranded. The footstep, this is gone, it is gone and though. It is a total transformation that we are going to be doing on this car. Complete, complete transformation. We are restoring every single thing on this car. I know I will pay attention to details, we are not missing anything behind. So when this customer receives this car, it's going to be seeing something different that, than the way it was before. It is something we are going to be doing. So I want you to watch out and see. But right now, I want to stay tuned. I'm going to invite Mr. Collins to tell us more about this car, inspiration and everything behind this car, with the design and how it all started. Stay tuned. So right here, we have Mr. Collins. And he's going to be telling us about this vehicle in details. So, Mr. Collins, you tell us more about this car. Thank you very much, sir. All right, so this car is a 1987 CMC Gazelle. Now, come closer, let's, let's talk a little bit. All right, so in 1929, Mercedes Benz released a car called the SSSK. So, it was supposed to be a race car. Yeah. Right, and it's very, very expensive, even though it's like almost. 80 years old right now so cmc in 1887 1987 they designed this car like in a in the spirit of that mercedes-benz sure. sssk so it's like a replica of that car now talking about the design of this car like you can see the way fresh is sitting down in this car right now this car is supposed to be for cruising the countryside right so it's very stylish it is first of all style before function so it's stylish not a, yeah so stylish. exactly so <laughs> <laughs> so I like, this car, I like the countryside. Yeah, so this guy is, a, is, is cruising for the countryside, right? Yeah. So it's a stylish way to move around. And if you look at this guy, it doesn't look anything like our today's car. You nah. can see, you can see the, the fenders is extended and it's different from the car. And uh, so it's just all about the style. It's all about something different, something alien. It's one of you can't see something. Like that. No, oh, where are you gonna see? <laughs> so this so, is a very. How much do you think this car goes initially when it was? Uh, I mean, the real um, design for this vehicle, not the replica now. But this is the replica yeah. for the original design. How much do you think it goes for? So the SSSK right now, you can. It's going for six million. At wow. Auction. Six, six million, million dollars. dollars. Million dollars, so that's, that's crazy. That's crazy amount of money. <laughs> that's like almost like how many? That's twelve Rolls Royce Phantom. That's a lot of money. So it's a very expensive car. It's a very rare and car. And despite the fact that this is a replica, uh, it's actually very expensive. Yes. Yeah. It's not a regular kind of person that can yes. afford it. Yes. So. Yes. Uh, because it's a replica does not mean it's affordable. Yeah, it's not. It's <laughs> not. And, and this is still very rare. And it's you probably... know you know it's a privilege for Fresh Tech to take yes. care of a baby like this. Yes, yes it is. And I think that is going to inspire us to so actually give our all to, to ensure we give it the best and yes. um, make something crazy out of this, you know. <laughs> what do you think um, 
inspired the design, the whole shape of this vehicle. Right, so if you can look at this car, you can see that it's not like our normal uh, modern sure, cars, right? Sure, so it looks yeah. alien somewhat. So this design is the pre-war design, right? Pre-World War II. Okay. You can see the fenders are extended and yeah, the outside. Sure. Our newer cars is the fenders and the body yeah, is one, together, yeah. it's one, to one body. And then the headlights is, is different from the body, like it's its own. Unit. So it's, an ancient it's like an ancient vehicle, <laughs> right? You're not going to see this on the road anymore. Yeah, no, no, no. It's not. It's not possible. <laughs> right. So, um, it's it's so. I feel so good working yeah. on this car. Yeah. Like I said, I'm going to put in my all, yeah. my passion, and everything yeah. to get this done. I'm yeah. not really a talkative person. This is a talkative <laughs> person. I'm a doer. I love fixing. So let him do all the talking and, while I go do and, the fixing. And, and, and another thing, if you see the way Frosh is sitting in this car right now, you can see that it's a chilling, it's a cruiser, right? So it's it's low roof convertible. It's just to enjoy the countryside, just to chill. The countryside, and, I like yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah, so it's the countryside. And that's what we want to give this, this owner. Right. We want to give him back his car to just chill around Lagos. You know? It's not going, you're not going to see. This is one of one. Right? Guys, watch out to seeing this anywhere. car on the road of Lagos. Yeah. And anywhere you see it, Frosh Tech signature Frosh is on it. Frosh Trust me, this is going to come out amazing. And also anticipate for the 300 Frosh rebranding. Yeah. It's also going to be crazily insane. I, I like using the word mad. It's going to be mad, mad, mad. So this is what we've got. And um, anticipate to seeing the end result of this car. You'll also be following up on our stories to follow up on the process of this build. It's going to be incredible. You're going to enjoy the whole process. Stay tuned, guys. I follow Fresh Tech. Share, like, and comment. Tell us what you think about this build. Tell us what you think we should do on this car and how we should go about it. But the car no more to elevate. Ori mi kole abanet. I'm bad, but I want to suffocate. But the bad don't want to tell